Even though she had the same vibe for his Hollywood debut movie as Coming to America 2 is set to be released. The Coming to America is a classic American comedy that was first produced in 1988. Yeah, the year I was born. I don't know about you guys. Oh, the story original cre originally created by Eddie Murphy. David o took to his Twitter account to show his IV to his official viewing. And yes, I'll be showing you guys mine. Very uh, soon. Yeah, no, not which very soon. <laughs> no, no, no. Immediately after this show, I'll be showing you guys. Just go to my Twitter page. Follow me at Mr. Fire One on Twitter just to see my invites. Don't go there for anything else. Just go and see my invite. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. How about you guys, man? What do you think? What do you mean, think? Coming to America. It's that movie. It's high. Like, it's high. Fam. You know, I have to say, though, because somebody corrected us on. On the mm. show, or was maybe it was me, because mm. yeah, nobody else, no, nobody on the table could figure that out. Mm. But they did. I remember we used to tell the black, come to the, can tell us what you feel about that, whatever. So I don't know if you remember when we we're talking about his movies and mm. like his acting yeah. or whatever. And I, I think I mentioned where I said he created um, the space. No, 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 no. That, Not that, that one. I, I yeah. said that with my full chest. <laughs> the one about the types of movies I acted. I was oh, okay, like, well, okay. I, didn't, I haven't seen many sci-fi movies. And that's because most of the sci-fi movies I know are like very like action okay, whatever. Yeah. But Star Wars this, in the the, yeah, exactly. But there is Doctor Doolittle, which is, Thank oh, you. Which is oh. very different from like the regular sci-fi. But it's still sci-fi. It's animation, mm. but it's still sci-fi. And he was Ain't in that. there. I love it. It's I love you because you take, the... you take you take you take your fall where you fall. Ah, that's a girl. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, you know. Yeah, yeah. I love you. I'm happy that you take your fall when you fall. Ah, no mind if it. No, he's allowed to take your fall when you fall. Uh, What's the point of falling if you're not gonna let the world know you? fell when I got back up. Ah, just Ooh. continue, please. Anyway, I'm, so, uh, you know, away from that, I'm glad that he has this movie that he's really, mm. like, you, you know, know, invested in mm. and that is doing really well. I think when you start to drag a, a movie for more than 30 years and mm. it's still relevant, then you know you're, you're, really? you have gold in your hands, long long basically. A few more years after 30. Uh, and you know, you so yeah. you know that you're really on something, you have gold yeah, in your hands. I'm really, really proud of him. I want to see what this looks like because I wasn't very, very impressed with part two, in my opinion. Part two? Yeah. You haven't was, seen it? It's not, it's not part two. They had a, an, another sequel. Coming to America? Yeah. Which one are you Maybe? watching? My dreaming. Mm -hmm. Yes, you are dreaming. I haven't seen it. Maybe I'm There's dreaming. no part two okay. coming to this. The there was something two. else that they did. Nothing after coming to Pretty America. Pretty sure it's not the first one. Okay. Hey, because you are not impressed to the fair. Hmm? Leave this table. Wait. <laughs> Just stand up. Remove your mic. Go and walk away. If you tell me you're not impressed, see, don't I'm speak. I'm not what? Impressed with the first coming to America. I mean, isn't there something else? Wasn't there, there something else? else? Like another version. Guys, no. I think there was another version. I haven't seen anything. So somebody was like, born in 1988. Just only one. Be telling me. What is it with your 1988? Calm Maybe down, now, please. Maybe now. was born in that year. Allow him to flourish. It's my year now. It's our year. Okay. Soft year. Okay. <laughs> well, I mean, if, that, if that's the only one, then it's fine. I just thought there was something else that maybe I watched no, or something maybe like that. Maybe you saw another Eddie yeah. Murphy movie. I yes, maybe. It was maybe. To America. Yes, maybe I'm mixing it up now. But either mm. ways, I'm excited about that. I want to see um, the. I mean, I've already seen like trailers and like mm. um, pictures of, of them. And then there are GQ, whatever, because his kids are mm. actually working on this mm -hmm. on this thing with them. Mm -hmm. So sure. I've read a bunch of interviews and stuff, and I know that they're quite intentional. Mm -hmm. Also, um, Obama's daughter is on this thing as well. Yeah, man. Not Really? Actor, but Mayla, a, yeah. Mala, as, a, Mala. as a staff or whatever. So let's let's see how it how it goes. How about you? What's your take on coming to America? The, amazing. I can't wait to see it. Definitely. Today can't wait to see it. Today you know. Mm -hmm. And today's my brother's birthday. Big shout out to you, big bro. Yeah, happy birthday to you. And thank God your birthday is dropping us at the same time as coming to America. Because yeah. I have to see the movie. Have you seen Are you seeing it today? How yeah, do I want to do it now? <laughs> okay, they gave me invite. Oh, why, why, why am I going back now? They gave us invite. I have one spare one. I'll the, choose between you. If I, who, who wants to come with me? I'm nobody, okay. nobody. I'm okay. Bobby Jackson, PJ <laughs> Ways. PJ Ways. Yay. Have you seen the track though? Um, Techno is on there, David yeah. is on there. Yeah. Um, yeah. I was very surprised because I did not Expected. know that. Yeah. There's quite a lot of Nigerians on mm -hmm. the track list. So mm -hmm. that's why I want to go listen to. Wow. Why do you think that is? Which is why I have a problem with what Quincy was saying that you have to have, you know, like um, an English speaking sound that's before you recognize. No. Before you recognize where? Abroad. In, in, in the we diaspora. both know that he was not talking in the. Great. In the in the sense, yeah, in the, yeah. Wow. talking in the nonsense, in the nonsense, in the in the BS. Mm. I think even um, even he knows because even Olamide has 
he clears out shows, believe it or not. Yeah. He clears out yeah. shows in the UK. He might not be as big as Whiskey or David, David O. o yeah. on the, in the grand scale of things, but he still clears out shows. Adequately, that I don't even understand most of the things he's talking about because I think he can't. Saying, you should start from Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. <laughs> Stop it, Don't mind it. Did you mean gold? Yes, and Adekunle Gold has some like really strong Yoruba songs, and he they eat him up in the UK. So like, it's not you don't have to speak English. We both know that. And even Quincy knew that. He knew it. He, right? knew. he was, so just, was playing himself. He didn't just want to. He was playing you know himself. You he wasn't ar- playing with us. You know, you know that thing you want to argue and you don't want it to show. Look like yeah, I'm, you know I'm to dumb. just find something else because the problem was that he didn't want to admit that. Um, it was dumb. Assurance. But um, the video perform- performing assurance was about the scandal that was going on on social media. Mm-hmm. That's mm-hmm. what the whole thing was but about. But wait, wait, wait. Okay, Emma was on the stage. Yeah. So you saw David and Jamie Kimmel performing assurance and Joe. Do you think that was a strategic move? <laughs> I don't know. You don't know? No, I don't. Ah, okay. What do you think, sir? Because do you suspect? Do you think oh, he would never do that? Or like there's a chance that it could be? It could be from what but, I've been hearing. But, mm. But it could be. That's all I can say. Mm. Well, I, I, it These is. People, they are, they are don't mind them. They eat together. Mm. It's you know we we don't have manners. That's why I think it's a mid thing. Yeah, 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 that's what I'm about to say. My guys. I will give you guys some manners. Don't worry. You give us some manners. Yeah. We don't need it. You need it. We're Malians. We want to say what we want to say, please. We want to say without being scared. Who wants, who wants I'm only to doing my job. Way. Look. Anybody can watch the show, have a problem with my opinion, mm. or I'm just doing my job. The same way I don't have a problem with your music. You say things in your music that I don't uh, yeah, support, exactly. or I enjoy your music. That's the same way you should enjoy my show, mm. whether or not I bash you or not. It's not, yeah. it's not your first thing. Mm? Like, you should enjoy my show. <laughs> like, yeah, you have to just enjoy like whether or not. enjoy my music. <laughs> <laughs> right? But you would, like to, you would like for me to enjoy your music, wouldn't you? Exactly. Yeah. So, I, I mean, there has to be, there has to be space is. for criticisms. And if, if, if at all it is true that David o was genuinely just um, performing the songs that he liked, and even if that scandal did not happen, mm. he would have performed those two songs, mm. I still think I'm allowed to say, well, I think that's some BS because mm. I suspect that that's not the reason mm. and it didn't just happen. I'm still allowed to say that, so it's not a big deal. Well, David O'Bain and coming to America, what do you think? Of course. Uh, Are you kidding? Being an, being an actor. I just want to see. Do you know when I saw the blog side, they said actor David Do. They did not say musician. They said yeah. actor David Do. Yeah. He's acted in a few movies now, hasn't he? Uh, I, I've, I not, I've, not, I've, seen I've not seen him. I've not seen him. I've not seen him. He's in. He's in. He always. He used to do Waka Pass. Exactly. Waka Pass he used to say, oh, hello, he was in um, Faith of a Lucky Jar. Even that one, yeah, M. Mina, Oscar Award winning. Oh my God, I'm for You don't walk up for every movie. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, I, I think he drops his face in, in movies. And I think he's going to drop his face here. I don't think he's going to have some massive role. No, that I, think, I, mean, I think he said one or yeah. two. Okay. I think he said one or two. One, something. Just a few. Uh, just, you know, I think he, he spoke. Ha- Hakuna, I keep calling Hakuna. Did you see Namaste Wala? Namaste Wala. I know, I've not seen it. Jesus Christ, what was that? Am I without drinking coca? <laughs> I'm gonna stop. <laughs> All right, guys. We actually need to move on before we bash our faves. You know what I mean? I'm All right. Fave, actually. It is actually. I, actually I see him actually. every morning, niggas. Sorry, okay. my apologies. The N word is always <laughs> running around, you know, trying to keep feed. And I'm trying to wonder, his brother, are you trying to disappear? Because you're small enough. <laughs> what are you talking about? Fred, that's not nice. What? what? Are you, is he talking about MI? Yeah. The N word. I wasn't even sure. No, he's talking about MI. Right. Yeah, yeah like, please don't, no, no bashing of MI is allowed on this table. All right, all right, all right, guys. We need to move on to the next story. So, famous female dick jockey DJ Copy has made a statement that suggests that she would rather cruise in a Ferrari than double into a beef. She wrote, why would I hop on some beef when I can hop in my Ferrari? Oh yeah, hop in my Ferrari. <laughs> <laughs> ah. That's the type of flex you want to have, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Everybody Everyone in the does. comment section said, well, the one your dad got you, she was like, exactly. And I'm like, yes, yes girl. girl. <laughs> <laughs> why she didn't, didn't my guy get exactly. me a Ferrari? Uh, my, my father bought me a Ferrari. I want to hop into it and you don't want me to ride. What did your father buy? <laughs> <laughs> Your father just be happy. That's the first question. Your father have a car. Did he buy you a car? Like, Does he have a car? Mm-mm, maybe he has a car now. The person's father. He can, it's possible. Oh, you be beefing somebody that their father got their car if your father you has a car. You think that car is the same thing as Ferrari? Don't let me oh, break that's it. Oh, that was true, Would you cry? Would you... Um, um, Why are you going to ask me this question for the girl? Because you, I brought, you brought the story up, so let me ask you. I wouldn't and cry for anything, though. Calm down, I'm coming. 
the other let's let's look at it the other way around. Would you be happy in a in a, in the car? Then would you be okay? Five seconds. Okay, would you be ha Would you rather be happy in a car and cry in a Ferrari? I wouldn't rather want to cry in a Ferrari. I'll be happy without a car. <laughs> Happiness is free. Okay. Happiness is your state of mind. Happiness is your being. Are I'm you always sure? happy. I was born happy. I'm supposed to be an happy child, a happy child, I mean. And yes, so whether in a car, whether in a Ferrari, but would I be happier in a Ferrari? Yes, of course. Hmm. <laughs> please give me my shop let me be crying in my Ferrari <laughs> okay, can you turn on the radio please <laughs> okay sweet uh -huh. I'll, I'll be happy you know in, in, all our question stuff car, is, is I will that. still pick the money up big it's okay of course you'll pick the money but trust me look you can have all the money see I've seen very rich people that their money has not been able to save or been able to help but you know the way. one I've seen for sure what that you cannot be too happy when you're poor. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, we well, see, we see like it on a daily. In fact, they will laugh with you. Suit. They will laugh with you with your money Fam. in the bank. Yeah. Even, when, even, the money when the bank. See, even when you're turning up when you're happy and when you're poor, you're still sad. Because you're like, ah, oh, hey, I lost my money. I'm going to calculate my money, my guy. You're like, ah, I'm going to calculate. I'm going to dance. Like, how, how much is that drink that I just ordered? I just paid 70k. Oh, 70k. Fam. 70k. Come on, you need 30k. You did this. Fam. You did this. Just a few days ago. Eh, babe, I was turning up and thinking, I would rather, <laughs> and you see the problems. I'm sorry, but the problems that I've seen that wealthy people have, yeah, are not problem. Are problems that can't be fixed by money. Mm. So that is like, and that's a life oh, okay, thing. Okay, okay, okay. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Like you said that, oh, money cannot fix it because they have cancer in their family. Oh, like you can have cancer when you're poor. So let me have no, that I'm, money. That one you I'm cannot treat it. it. <laughs> I think they are going through treatment. Do you understand? And even, the, even the they are giving them breakfast. I'm telling you, they carry it to Dobby. And your leg will be up there. You'll be sharing with somebody see, that has you, something see, else. Dobby is orthopedic. No, they will carry it to Dobby for cancer I'm because sorry. you don't have money. Nah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please, let's just hustle, guys. Let's hustle. <laughs> there's no, there's no need to romanticize the idea of poverty. It's okay. Just make as much money as, as you can. As you can. Okay. As you can. Okay.